not sure, so it's a bit of an awkward collision. There is an intent in it, as far as I can see, so it's going to be a yellow card to number three. I agree. Thank you very much. So, okay. it's going to be a second yellow card. There was serious discussion over the colour of the card, and it's yellow for Todd Furlong. OK, Captain. Come with me, I'll speak to number three, and I'll speak to their captain as well. Oh, uh, listen, I agree with you, you don't need to speak to me. And three. Well, let's hear I'll the explanation. Because I want to explain this. Okay? It is clear foul play. You've made no effort to wrap. Okay? What I do understand is his head has popped out and it's an awkward collision. So it's going to be a yellow card. When you come back on, I need you to be behaved. Fair enough? Yeah, so this, and Blue started it. Yeah, yeah. So we're going to penalise Blue first, restart with a penalty here for the yeah. flat. Well, the reaction yeah, as well. well. Okay, thank you. So, yeah. Okay. Two captains. Andre. Well, it's both of them in trouble and deserve to be in trouble too. Listen, quite frank. So we've had a look at the footage. You've seen it there. What we've got is two blue has thrown it. The first punch. AR has clearly seen close fist to the head, and then number two has also returned fire with close multiple close fists to the face. So it's two red cards, two blue and two black, and we're going to restart with a penalty here. Yeah, the black. So that is a great call. Blue so I think he's got it spot on. Yeah, that is a great red call from Mark yeah. Fraser. Yeah. That's, that's not needed yeah. in rugby. And that's the way it's supposed to be. No boxing on the rugby field. And discipline is key. Oh, keep the aggro off the field. It's going to be, yeah, black penalty. Well, and both yeah. these players will now be yeah, sanctioned it's be, it's your and have to sit out for a couple of weeks. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think anyone can yeah. really... And thoroughly deserved. One of them will win their case. Okay, can time's going on. Judicial case and review in the week. Captain out here. Had been awarded, I think, so Wilson now. after the decision has been awarded, your number six has come in and tapped an opponent on top of the head. I told you about this before the match. You didn't want to see any of it. Yes, no, stop. No, relax. No, this is what happened, and you're going to be penalised for it now. <coughs> Discipline on your players. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Get the message out. This is your this is your problem now. Sort it. Very clear, very clear there from George Clancy, and you see, I actually spoke about it. There's Ryan Wilson. <laughs> That is not Swinnow's head. <laughs> and anything can happen, and this time they get the decision. And the big man wants the ball back quickly. Seven. 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 Oh, yeah, Vuka. Just come here a second. Stand, oh, oh, no, 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 stand. stand over here. Stand over here. Lads, no, no. Just give me some space, please. Take some space. You, I, don't listen to me. You have the penalty. Keep calm, OK? So I don't have to reverse, OK? We are, Ed. We can have a, we can have a completed one. We are. Oh, they pop up in the front row. No, we don't. Time off. Two front rows. Just the two front rows. Nobody else, please. Captain, I'll just speak to the front rows. Nothing. I don't want anything from anybody. Right, lads, as far as I can see, both teams are to blame. I have no interest in you sending these scrums. No one else on the ground does, and none of the other players do. Right? Between the six of you, you sort it out, or we'll get some other players on to sort it out. Right? Let's go. And well, this time it's a monster penalty. It'll be interesting to see um, the interpretation there. I think uh, Eddie Matheson's enthusiasm arriving in might be deemed provoking this outcome. It was definitely uh, putting a, a frustrating, a frustrated figure. Captain and nine. Uh, yes, captain and nine. Okay. We had a penalty there for you, for our feet. He has come in from some distance and caused all of that. And then he's continued. Good, no, stop. No. He's continued when I've asked him to stop. So the penalty is going to be reversed. Okay, no. No, he would argue, you see, I was only getting the ball. 
but he knows a player of his caliber knows full well he's provoking an outcome by rushing in as quickly as he is and i think it's good refereeing it's an yeah, ungentlemanly course. conduct okay, you need, you need from the monster scrum half it caused it and he carried on afterwards no 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 i don't need to speak to you again no no i don't need to speak to you again please can i not can you move back can you ask right cj move back now please move back no, 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 no. now he's pushing his way step back now please yeah. I would agree, yes. Yeah. Uh, there is direct shoulder contact to the head of the Ulster player. It could okay. be a red card. Right. Could be a, so I think because Balakun like is being here, tackled and going to down... Red card, black 12. I would give it a and yellow, a yellow card, I think it could, be a, it, could be, it could be a double card here. Yeah, well, under the, going from what we've the got current directors of laws... Yeah, Lloyd okay, Linden and Andy McManamy agreeing that it's a red card uh, for Kruger. And uh, a yellow, I suspect, for Van Rooyen. Captain from Alan, do you want to come and this? Can you bring me number 12 yep. and number 16, please? Hello. Uh, so the first one I'm going to deal with is number 12. Okay. So what we're seeing is a shoulder, no attempt to wrap the arms, direct contact to the head and you've looked at him before you do it. So I'm seeing no other option there than a red card for yourself. Through Aaron Wainwright, and now it's been turned back over. <laughs> Sam Davis <laughs> gives it to Nigel. Good take, Nigel, good take. <laughs> and wait, wait uh, for, the, for the multiple hits. That's a free hit, isn't it, surely? <laughs> If he's ever done no, anything to uh, to annoy you, that was the time to get him back. You were asked if it was be your ball. Sorry, boys, the ball came straight to me. Right. It was a call like a mullet. Okay, we've got the call for 15. 2003, off, right? 2004. Okay. All I've got there is handbags. Thanks very much. Conic and Minolta. Captain Black and Captain Red. Time is off. Long time ago. You were probably about four. Okay. Right. Okay. Gentlemen, you need to get all your players here, okay? We've got a number of issues here, okay? Players off the ball. I need 15 black to come to me, please. 15 black, you can go. 15 black, please. I think the assistant well, sees something off. He's clearly offside. You had a team warning. Leave it there. Thank you. Uh, wow. You know, fair enough. Yeah. Good on him. Yeah. Call from the referee as Stu Venegas sends up another box kick with the left peg. Nobody took it. Looked like Padovani was odds on to grab that for Zebra. Well, back we come again. Oh, that's twice the referee has fallen into the action. Pardon me for laughing. But he has a laugh himself. We don't want to see this. I mean, the game, there's been a lot of stuff start here. Scrum resets. Let's have a listen to the referee. I, I cannot accept that. That's exactly what I tell you in the changing room, OK? I want a clear space, yes. and I want you to expect my call. No pre-engage. So I want to see a clear, clear space. Is that clear enough? Do we move OK. Yeah, move so, still the least disciplined side in the Heineken Champions yeah. Cup. And Tudor's throw. Centre. Absolutely the right decision, but with throw, almost certainly goes Castro's challenge in Europe. But, but that's the thing, who's, who's scalpel? I think you have to take Fraser well, McKenzie's lift the leg. This is super seen, its level of severity. This is much more severe than a, than a high tackle. Lodi's back on his feet, which is good to see. Yeah, it's the right so it's Fraser McKenzie that's being called two, two over. Seconds. What's happened is, you picked the man up, yeah. he has gone through the horizontal, he's landed on the side of the shoulder, it's going to be a yellow card. You haven't got any regard for the player's safety there, it's a yellow card. So Edinburgh down to 14 men. Early. With England, you know, there was history there, there's a bit of beef. Chris Vassaro and Brad Barrett. I know he's a patient about the game. When I go my and I make a decision, yeah. just you have to control your, your yeah, team absolutely. and you're your team. Perfect. Perfect. Fun? Perfect. Uh, who starts with the mark? Uh, Marcus. Yeah. From the penalty, where's the mark? The, the penalty, the mark is here. Yeah, the it's nowhere near as just, much fun uh, to have players who are slightly out of control, though, Jim, isn't it? And you're the same. Oh, definitely not. See? See how that was? Of course. Saracen's uh, chain. Uh, 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 skeleton. Far away from joining us. Is off. 
Okay, listen. Right. Okay, he hasn't got the ball. You have made an attempt to wrap and it's only hit the chest. This is his warning, okay? If I have anything more from you, you will be having 10 minutes in the bin. Oh, is that clear? Yeah, okay, good. penalty here for offside or penalty for a lick tackle? What's the one? Back 10, lads, please. The choice of penalties. Literally, simultaneously. For the yeah. Ospreys. Yeah, okay. I suppose you, you, you want a second row who's going to put himself offside. about. Yeah, so it's the first. No, it's definitely a lick tackle. He's definitely had two steps, three steps to pull out of it. Yeah. The sufficient force that I'm going to go yellow card for that. So that's a second yellow card for the Cardiff Blues. They are now down to uh, 13 men. Brad Fire, another four minutes uh, in the sin men, but he will have warmed the tackle. chair up for okay. Nick Williams. Well, you live by the sword, you die by the sword, don't you? you, know, you play... Yeah, making contact with the head first. Great. So it's clearly after the ball has been scored. He's had every opportunity to not commit to that. It's contact the head with force. It's a maximum penalty of a red card. That is correct. That right. is a red card. Number six, please. That is the correct call. Uh, I need to explain it to you. Good, Barry. Ball's clearly been, yes. tries been scored already. Contact to the head, red card. He knew it. He saw it. He'd seen it on the big screen. And even his, his teammates had tapped him on the head because they knew. And Marius confirmed we're starting with a penalty because it's after the... We've got white 16 clearly around the neck. Agreed. He pulls the player to floor. And his head is true, um, pulled to the floor, making head to floor contact. Yeah, so it's a grab of the neck, a lift of the player, and he's and he's forced. To, well, he's driven, driven, dropped. Yeah, driven and dropped, lands on head. On head, yes. So and it's prolonged, mate. So it there's a prolonged. lot of um, factors yeah. here. Yeah. So with all those factors, I'm at red card for white 16. I agree. You need to give me a more, and I'll just explain this. This could yes, prove okay. very costly indeed yeah, for Bath. Captain, please. 16 Let's white. listen in. We know Captain what's coming. 16. Well, this match has taken please. another dramatic twist, or at least is about to. It's a prolonged neck roll. You twist him and you pull him to floor, and he goes head direct to the floor. Okay, that's a red card offence. <laughs> Where the ball is. Mark with the eight point lead. Okay, it's Must play the last 17 minutes, minutes of the match. We just fought a small bit of sympathy for James though he was just running a full tilt just reckless moment and he's going to face the ultimate price of a record both captains please captains he went to zero to 120 rather rapidly yeah but it's, it's there's been a lot of infringements oh, yeah. at the play of the ball in, in, in that wreck situation. Players trying to slow this. So your responsibility now, you're going to speak to the players. If I give a penalty, you're going to tell the players not to charge in and push and shove like you are. The whistle is gone. You can speak to the players immediately. They'll have a look if some of these foul play for us as well. So you can speak to the players. Time is off. Time is off. Look, Captain, he's not in a realistic position. He's taken him out in the end. He's landed, landed dangerously. It's a red card. Yeah. And you probably heard the referee constantly, isn't he, this first half? I don't think there's been a lot for him really to be that pleased with when you look at the score line okay. so far. Uh, we have a timeout now, please. We have the front six here, please. Okay. Front you six. can see Sampson. And captain, please. There. Yes. He's still suffering with that blood injury. It'll be interesting to see if he's allowed you have to stay done on. Maybe three, maybe four scrums. Excellently. No problem. So you can do it. On other scrums? I think you were just being lazy and you were not taking the contest, you're not listening to my calls. We go in, we set up and we wait until the calls and when the ball is in, then you drive legal and we carry on. So you need to work hard on every scrum, please. Thank you. You can't get any clearer than that, can you, for Nigel Owens? And interestingly, yes, the both sides. he's only said it in English. Rory Cockett was there translating to his front row. Il y a un essai, on va rester sur l'essai. En ouais. revanche, après l'essai, vous venez, vous plongez, il n'y a pas de genou flexion, ça sera carton jaune. Vous, vous vous rendez, ça sera carton jaune et on reprendra par pénalité contre le blanc qui met le premier geste. On reste sur l'essai, par contre, ces deux messieurs vont se reposer parce que l'attroupement et l'accrochage, c'est pas ça. Il y a un essai, 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 il y a un